Okay, to add a test, you're going to click Command I, OK. Another way to do it is Edit, Add Test, and hit OK. I like to give my test numbers, my test or assignments. It doesn't just have to be a test, this can be for any assignment. And then give it a name like homework, um, the scientific method and it'll display all of that. Uh, it'll only show you a small amount, but on your reports, it'll show you the whole thing. Okay, it'll automatically add the quarter. Your category, you can have categories like labs, homework, tests, quizzes, things like that. To change the date, you double click it. You should be able to just alter the date. You put the total points that it is worth, say that's 20, and then you just add your grades. Um, if you have an extra, if you give extra credit or you allow extra credit points, if you put a score that's higher than um, the possible points, you have to click yes and confirm it. Okay, so that's how to enter grades. Um, how to send grades. Okay, so that's how to enter grades. If you want to change your grading scale, you can click set grading scale. If you find that um, students there don't have Fs in your column all the way over your yearly grade, you're probably going to have to change this number down here to zero. And that will, um, when you hit OK, that will allow Fs to show up instead of being stars. Another thing that you can do is uh, assign grading symbols, so set grading symbols. I like to add MI for missing work. You can add any sort of symbol that you want. So you can actually, you can have them, for example, you add one and you want to say ABS means that the student is absent and it allows them to be exempt. You can do that. And now if you put in ABS, notice that the grade doesn't go down. So that's how you change your grading um, symbols too. If we want to delete this column, you want to go edit, delete student test, and choose the column you're going to delete. Yes, and there all the work that I just did is gone. So sometimes you may want to delete the column. So those are basic how to enter grades, very basic. Um, stay tuned for more Edline tutorials on more complicated subjects.